What are Friot's Laws? Friot's Laws are a set of three guiding principles meant to describe specific motions of the cervical, thoracic, and lumbar spine. While in practice these laws are seen as simplistic, they do provide a framework from which a clinician can work. The first two laws solely apply to the lumbar and thoracic regions. The third applies to the entire vertebral column. Law 1. When the spine is in neutral, side bending to one side will be accompanied by horizontal rotation to the opposite side. So what this means is when your spine is aligned and you side bend to the left, for example, it will simultaneously be rotating to the right, the opposite side. These are known as coupled motions. Law 2. When the spine is in a flexed or extended position, in other words, not neutral, side bending to one side will be accompanied by rotation to the same side. So, per the previous example, when your spine is not in alignment, side bending to the left will be coupled with rotation to the left, the same side. Law 3. When motion is introduced in one plane, it will modify or reduce motion in the two other planes. The planes this law is referring to are the frontal, sagittal, and transverse planes that make up the movements of side bending, flexion and extension, and rotation respectively in the spine. So simply put, this law states that if you move in one plane of motion, such as flexion or extension, the other two planes of motion, rotation and side bending, will not occur as much.